After six years together, wrestler Nikki Bella has broken off her engagement with John Cena. John promised her he would have kids. I just want to be a mom. I will make that sacrifice for you. I will give you a child. But was John just manipulating her the whole time? You said that you don't want kids of your own. I won't have kids. Now that Nikki has left him, John is playing the victim. I want to make her my wife. I want to be the father of the children. Will Nikki fall for it? I had my heart broken out of nowhere. I still love Nicole. I still would love to marry Nicole. I still would love to have a family with Nicole. When John Cena declared on live TV that he wanted to have kids with Nikki, it was the opposite of what he had been telling her for years. It's kind of confusing. Last we talked, like, that pretty much was it. Like, if I want to be a mom, there's no John. But I love him so much. When Nikki met John, she knew she wanted to start a family with him, even though he wouldn't commit to it. But from the start, she put his needs before her own. You make a lot of sacrifices for me, and I haven't done anything. I asked you to move to Tampa thinking it'd be a good thing, but I didn't even once think that you uh, would be plucked from your home. Nothing's worse than hearing the man you love be like, I will never get married again. I will not have kids. But after five years together, it looked like John was finally ready to give Nikki what she needed. I have been waiting so long to ask you this. Will you marry me? It was magical. I've never once doubted our love. Nikki was giving up on her biggest dream so she could be with John. You've said that you don't want kids of your own. I told you that I don't want to have kids. Do you think there'll be children down the line? No, there won't. John doesn't want kids, so we're not gonna have kids. But as Nikki watched her sister and her friends start families, she realized that she couldn't let that dream slip away. Another person around me is having a baby. I'm done. These feelings of really wanting to be a mom, but I love you so much. That's always been worth sacrificing it for. I'm gonna choose my words carefully. I can't give you that. As painful as it was for her, Nikki called off the wedding. So when you go through wedding planning, you just start to go through a lot of issues maybe that you're hiding deep down inside. I just might have made the worst decision of my life or I might have just made the best decision of my life. It's hard to realize you'll never be on the same page with someone you love. And what could have helped was an important conversation you never took the time to have. Something to help avoid a point of no return like with Nikki and Sina. Something like today's sponsor, Paired. Paired is a relationship app on a mission to make couple relationships happier and healthier. It creates an open environment to spark deep conversations with your partner that you normally wouldn't have, prompting daily conversations with their question packs on a variety of topics. And in this case, finding out if you want the same things as a couple. Nikki could have asked Sina, what were they not willing to compromise on in the future? But it's not just about airing out mismatched expectations. Paired also has fun couple quizzes and games like the new You or Me game to test out each other's relationship knowledge. So try it out for yourself and discover your relationship's strengths and growth areas together. Click my link below on the description box and get 25% off Paired Premium so you can maintain and deepen your connection with your partner and avoid reaching a relationship crossroads like Nikki and Cena. But later, Nikki was shocked when John suddenly changed his mind on live TV. I want to be with her. I want to make her my wife. I want to be the father of her children. Was there any part of you that watched that and thought, I wish you would have just given me a phone call instead of told the world? I mean, of course. It's just so hard. I just want to be a mom. Nikki decided she couldn't let go of John and she took him back. And once again, while the cameras were rolling, John made a promise to her, but something about it wasn't right. I want to marry you, and I will, uh, I will make that sacrifice for you. I will give you a child. But I got so excited that he wanted kids, I couldn't believe it. I never thought I'd hear that. But I realized there was just such a deeper problem. He said he wanted kids and I ran right back, not even fixing myself and ignoring all the other issues. And I think especially as women, we sometimes put everyone else first and we forget about us. But I need to stay strong and know that I really have to fix me. Nikki realized it was better for both her and John to not have kids together. And she was finally putting herself first. And I feel like the first time ever, I'm focusing on me. Honestly, I'm ready for a new me. And when Nikki met someone new, she didn't put her dreams second this time. I would say he's like the sweetest person I have ever met in my entire life. But I feel like because of my past relationship, I held a lot in to be such a pleaser right. that when I got into this relationship, I was like, I'm just gonna fully communicate how I feel. Yeah. And it has made me very strong in the relationship. By putting herself first, 
Nikki's dream finally came true. I'm pregnant. Honestly, nothing gets better than this woman right here. Oh, I feel like I'm so scary, right, little one? Thank you.